February 18, 1981, Margaret Thatcher reverses course on her plan to close 23 coal mines, marking her first major U-turn since taking power. Joseph Gormley of Greater Manchester, who has served as the president of the National Union of Mine Workers from 71 to 82, played a prominent role in the events. A former miner himself, Gormley had risen through the ranks of the union to become a leading trade union official. During his tenure as president, he oversaw a national strike in 1970 and a threatened strike in 1981. Although some miners continued to strike unofficially, militant leaders called off the strikes on February 20th. Gormley resigned in April 1982 to be replaced by Arthur Scargill, who would later lead the miners in a year-long strike starting in 1984.